back in October, I decided to take the plunge and uh, make a, a pretty big investment in my vehicle. I mean, outside of, of uh, maybe an engine swap, um, the next biggest investment you can make in your E30 is, is basically gonna boil down to your air ride. So uh, like 99.9% .9 of the world, I was considering going the airlift way. And uh, that was until I, I saw that there was some welding required and whatnot. So I, I just kept looking and I was kind of surprised. I'm like, why isn't there anything else out there? Why don't they just offer, offer the whole strut and whatnot? And lo and behold, I ran into a company called The Loot uh, on Instagram and, and took that gamble because honestly, uh, I, I searched everywhere and didn't find any info whatsoever on The Loot. Um, uh, me and, and along the way, I forged some friendships, one of them with a guy named Jags out in London. And uh, he and I just kept in touch because once I hit, uh, put it in the car and I hit pay, that's pretty much it. Now. The loot is basically owned and, and managed by a guy named Victor, and, and uh, you just have to have some patience. His, his business is really exploding, so it, it took three months and uh, to get this. Uh, so October, November, December, originally was offered for mid-November, but again, it, it's, a, it's a business that's really exploding. And, and I think once you see the product, you'll see why. So this entire air ride kit, along with uh, the spindles, was uh, $1,850 at the time. Um, and that's with a manual um, uh, air management. So uh, with that said, I just wanna show you what $1,850 gets you. All right, so as soon as you unbox it, you see you get a uh, set of airlines, uh, allegedly about 50 feet. Uh, this is my first air ride kit, so I don't know what a good line or a bad line looks like. I will say that this looks pretty durable. Next thing that you get is a box of fittings. Uh, these are a mix of steel and plastic from the looks of it. But I guess they're enough here to be able to do uh, the entire kit. You also get two switches in this box for uh, up and down. I guess you can control the front and the rear individually. Came with a uh, 40 amp relay along with the harness and the relay. I'm sorry, and a fuse, inline fuse. I have uh, some of these components I'm gonna be upgrading. And I believe this is the pressure switch. So this is what lets the uh, compressor know to turn on whenever the tank is running low on there. So that's what came with that box. Um, all right, also came with a needle gauge, so to find out how much air you have in your system. All right. Here's the valve for unit set up here for four lines. Now I'm gonna show you the one that I ordered. I ended up, uh, Jags and I have been discussing for a while. He has an E28 that he's installing this kit on as well. Um, and he went a different route and I'm gonna go that same route. I'll show you uh, once I start getting ready to put this in. But this is what comes in a box. It's very solid feeling. Comes with some screws and the harness. These are struts and they're coil over type. The bags again, they look pretty solid. And so does, so does the hardware here. So we get uh, two of these. Second one, two bags for the rear. Again, the hardware looks, looks beautiful. But this is my first kit, so I don't have anything to really compare it to. A complete harness, I guess for the uh, for the switch, for the air management, the compressor. <coughs> uh, sock type filter. The 
holes and force in this thing is super duper duper happy. Inlet air filter, I guess for, for any water. And some more holes. This is the aluminum tank. That way up. That's what you have. This is a three gallon. I guess I may be upgrading this. And when I first opened it, I, I was gonna say this was a nice touch by Victor. Um, he included some uh, some candy in there, some chocolate, which uh, I gotta say, um, thank you, Victor. Nice touch, buddy. And here are the spindles. So as you know, Airlift does not provide this, and there's no kit. There's no one out there really offering this. And it's a screwing type, so I guess you put those in, screw them in, and that's pretty much it. So, this is $150 all in, got me. I know he's uh, been running a sale, which is actually even better than uh, what I paid for all of this. But, with that said, uh, I guess as we move forward here, um, some springs and bolts and screws here as well. So as we move forward here, I guess uh, you guys will be along for the journey. 